So I know the lighting is shitty in here. <laughs> Let's just start the video off by pointing out all the flaws. I am a mess. I just finished running. It's my gym back there. Um, it is, let's see, 9.15 p.m. Central Standard Time. And, you know, I, I originally wanted these to be a bit more productive and informative and, you know, have all my ducks in a row before I made these. But I had a thought this evening and I think it's something that needs to be shared because... Everyone is always about positivity and motivation and, you know, find the thing that motivates you, find people that help motivate you, find something that motivates you and you'll feel good when you're done and, you know, exercise just cures everything and everyone's going to be so happy and blah, 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 talking out of their asses. Everyone's different, and I don't mean that in a cliche way. I mean that genuinely. <laughs> Everyone is different. For example, I've had a really <laughs> crappy, long, weird, exciting, terrifying <laughs> last, what, week or so. It's just been a whirlwind of emotions in my life on so many fronts. It ranges from many different highs and lows. So I've got a lot going on in my life. There's uh, friendship issues, there's relationship issues, there's physical issues, there's plenty of mental issues. I got those for days. Everyone has been expecting everything of me recently. I don't just mean, like, do your best, but my kids have been crazy. My husband has been stressed with work and being irrational crazy. My best friend has been having some issues. I have another friend who things just got awkward with and I wish I could say it was in a good way I want it to be in a good way but that's not where I'm at yet that's not where this person's at yet either I am in charge of a group of about 100 plus people that are demanding and childish and crazy my anxiety level has been through the roof and it's just been non-stop and I'm so tired. I did not want to come running tonight. I promised my trainer I would and here I am and I finished and I didn't want to do it. So I got here and I was like okay I can get this done. I'm gonna go through with it and then I can go home and go to bed and then not have to worry about it until tomorrow or the day after that. It'll be great. And I get about a mile into it. I run two and a half miles. I'm supposed to run two and a half miles every time I run. So I get about a mile into it and I start getting tired, which is pretty normal for me. And I'm like, okay, I'm gonna walk some. And I had felt really good up until that point. And then out of nowhere, this lady, starts pacing back and forth behind me and I'm really agitated right now just in general not so much with her but just in general things just are I'm at my wits end with everything and she's pacing back and forth and pacing back and forth and she's on her phone and She's got her phone turned up so loud you can hear the dude she's talking to. She's got the squeakiest little voice and you know like the little dee flirting shit and it's driving me nuts. Like in my head I just, I want to turn around and I want to punch this lady. No reason. It's not like she was, you know, making fun of me or talking about anything inappropriate. Just, just the way she was and being around me and I was so mad and I wanted to stop. And I wanted to just, you know, 
at 1.25 miles, I think in my head I was like, I could just go home now. I, I don't have to finish this. There's no way that I have to do any of this. I could just go home and I'd be done. Fuck this, I'm done. Fuck this lady that I don't even know. Fuck it all. But I want other people to know that it happens. There's a lot that goes into running mentally. I don't know if this is for everybody um, at better fitness levels than me, but I can say for my size and my personality and me in general, you know, period is coming soon. I am PMSing. I am crazy right now, hormonally. I am just losing my mind. But I want other people to know that it's not always sunshine and rainbows. And long story short, I talked myself out of it. I talked myself out of a lot of quitting while I run. Not just tonight, but pretty much any time I, I do it. Like a hostage situation. I'm a fucking crazy person. And I just... I want others to know that that's normal. And if you genuinely want to make a change, don't let your mind win. I know I'm not right in my mind. I know I have hormones against me. I know I have life situations against me. I know that I have myself against me. But aside from all that, I I won. <laughs> I did it. I took a lot longer than I normally do. <laughs> and I'm not proud of that, but I finished and I burned almost a thousand calories in 40 minutes. And that's something that I can be proud of. Like even now I'm hormonal and I'm trying not to cry, which is ridiculous because there's, there's nothing to cry about. Nothing happened. I'm going to be so proud of myself tomorrow. I'm really distressed right now and angry at myself for letting all this happen and not really letting it happen but thinking this way and it's so frustrating because you know you feel like a couple months into something you're getting better at it you see the progress that's happening I have some great news that I want to share about my progress but I'm gonna do that another time because I'm not in any kind of mood to share that right now these hurdles that I'm jumping through I'm seeing that I can do this and it's still hard <laughs> and I think that's the hardest part about people trying to get in shape the thing that's that kept me going was knowing I can't let those thoughts win all the time and they didn't tonight as as much as they're gonna win as soon as I get home and am free to have whatever is brewing in my hot mind happen they can win there but they didn't win here in this gym behind me that's where I'm pointing I'm so proud of myself because the urge to stop was definitely stronger than the urge to keep going so if you've ever felt this way know that you're not alone but that you should be proud of yourself for continuing 